go on with the example. 1.1 cubic meter containers. The hydraulic tipping device picks up the container, empties it, and puts it down again. The compaction device presses the refuse into the stowage section. And the last example of its use, the emptying of multi-bucket system containers up to seven cubic meters. Here, as an example, the 2R has a semi-trailer version with a 28 cubic meter loading section. To demonstrate the mighty loading capacity of the 2R, we've just driven this vehicle onto a weigh bridge and had the total weight measured. This 28 cubic meter semi-trailer managed to take a full 32 tons and 80 kilograms at the weigh. Powerful performance, isn't it? Unloading at the refuse tip. It's the same 2R that we've just seen on the weigh bridge. And once again, the now familiar cycle goes into operation raising the tailgate, emptying the container, and beginning the push-out intervals, which we have shortened here for time reasons. Please just pay attention to the optimum compaction of the refuse, indeed from back to front along the whole stowage section. And one more thing, because of the grid system, the superstructure of the 2R can always be matched to your individual requirements, because it's been planned in such a way that it can be fitted without any problems to any chassis. Once again, this always guarantees absolute economy in the disposal of bulky and industrial refuse with every size of superstructure and on any chassis. Schoening refuse compactors do their work reliably all over the world. The 2R in particular has proved itself for years in daily application and taken its firm place in the vehicle park of municipal and private refuse removal operations. Below us you see the main factory of the Schoening Company in Hanover. Behind us, the experience of over 65 years in which we have constructed municipal vehicles. And in front of us, the aim in future to continually develop our product and to maintain a high level of quality. That and the acknowledged high customer service have made Schoening one of the most important producers of municipal vehicles. And that's how it's going to remain. Many thanks for your attention.